So here's the celestial tier. This is the first through fifth positions on the SGL. We're looking at total EXP from the last seven days. And at first, are you surprised? We have TSL. Uh, but bombs, thank you so much for the support. Thank you for being part of Couch Cat. All right, we have TSL with 60, almost 62 mil earned in the first position or total. We have Factor Reset at number two with 48 mil total. We have Friendly at number three at 35 mil total. We have The Force at 33. Three mil total at number four. And number five, this is the current shakeup in Slash Shield here. Wolf Blood is diminished at 32 mil total. But look, we got Silver Wolf, we got Deeran, we got Dagon, we got Zildin and Yukari. We got so many heavy hitters in Wolf Blood. I'm not even shook from this, okay? Uh, and I know I will be able to carry the guild if I wanted to, and I'm probably going to. And we're going to get back to fourth place. This is, this is, a true rivalry now okay so don't if you're wolf blood don't fret I, I got this okay i got this but anyway okay darren let's not they're insane we're going to be legendary next let's not be negative about it <laughs> and now now so we're saying pies and holding us back <sighs> okay i gotta stay strong i gotta stay strong why why would my guildy why would my own guildies want to be nice to me on stream why kuma why why would they want you know, I was thinking about cracking a beer tonight. I probably should have brought the beer. Okay. Okay. No, that's not all start saying I'm holding back. You mother. So what do we earn this week? Uh, so TSL earned 14.5 mil. Factory, 14 or 12.1. Friendly, 7.3. Forced, 8.2. And Wolf, 7.3. So clearly TSL and Factory are still very strong. Uh, third place is looking like... It's going to be threatened by fourth and fifth, but I think it'll be. I don't think friendly is going to catch up to to fr. Okay, there's just no way. All right, let's move on to legendary tier before I look at chat and cry. So this is the sixth through tenth position. We have DPS. Oof. Remember when they were fifth place and they were the best PVE guild? Well, <laughs> they're still the best PVE guild, but now they're sixth place and it's not as cool. So DPS here at thirty two mil total. At number seven, we have Prostor with 15 mil total. Wow, what a huge, what a huge gap in EXP or just total EXP. This is so wild. But Prostor, very strong guild. Uh, right behind them, they have Shadow Garden with 14.9. They have Sanctuary, which is the guild in question. Babel 3.9. No, I'm not going to start that train. I don't have to do anything. Their actions will speak louder than my words, okay? So if they're a hardcore PvP guild, with their nine place, you know, places forward. That's what they're going to be, man. Congrats to them. Nine positions forward to get to ninth place. That's insane. And then Knights Who Say Yigin just mud blasted in the Chipotle toilet at number 10. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, chat. <laughs> My God. <laughs> anyway, let's look at, uh, let's look at earned. <laughs> So DPS earning 9.5, just blowing these guilds out of the water here in Legendary tier. Prosser earning 3.3, Shadow 4.1. They have exams, I think. Uh, they have exams every day. Uh, if you if you ask anyone in Shadow Garden, it's just exam season 24-7 because uh, they never grow up. So Sanctuary earning 7.6. That's where you see them just blasting forward. and We're going to go to the other tiers, and they probably screwed every other guild behind them, and that's just going to be great to see. And then the Knights who say only earning 2.3, so they're probably going to drop out Legendary. They're probably going to drop out Legendary. Let's find out, shall we? Oh, Lord, they probably will. Okay, so here is the 11th through 15th position. We have Still Friendly 2 at 12.6 total EXP. Amazing stuff here. Moving to position forward. Everyone else is, <laughs> is just destroyed by uh, Sanctuary. So 12, we have Heaven Hell getting dropped to position with 11.6 mil. Italia, fake Italians at 13. 11.5 mil earned. Three positions dropped, dude. Rest in peace. Uh, Murders of the Universe at 14 with 11.4. And DGK, also known as Demos, Big Booty uh, Kingdom. Uh, at number 15 with 10.3 mil dropping down. So all these skills just got shattered through, you know, the wake of Sanctuary, but still friendly too, able to take advantage with their EXP, uh, and securing the top position in Epic. Let's see what everyone was earning though. 
3.9 mil, 2.7, 2.23 mil, 2.5, pretty standard across the board here in Epic. So it, once, you know, the, the next week will show who's actually still able to hang Sanctuary. It's going to, you know, it causes some speed bumps along the way with the, with a push like that. Um, but, you know, we'll see how things shake out. Don't you just like saying that? Like, well, I wonder how that's going to shake out. Like, uh, when LTS texts me, they're like fifth day in Colorado and there's basically like a tornado in their neighborhood. And you're just like, I wonder how that's going to shake out LTS. <laughs> okay. I thought that was funny. Okay. Moving on to elite. So <laughs> elite 16 through the 20th positions here. We have resolve dropping out of, um, uh, the tier above to number 16 with 9.9 .9 total mil uh 9.9 .9 mil total uh at number 17 we have the unknown at 9.6 mil holding strong in that position they didn't they didn't get dropped by sanctuary and they didn't really they didn't move forward but they earned probably on par with uh this tier asgard okay the biggest the biggest shocker hold on chat the biggest shocker this season is Asgard dropping to elite tier? I cannot, I cannot let Jason get away with this shit. This noob has let this beautiful tier two guild that has risen like a phoenix drop like a bunch of noobs, like a like a bunch of newbie potatoes. Jason, when you watch this, I hope you cry and get stronger like in the animes. Thank you. But yeah, dropping two positions down to number 18. Hate to see it happen to my boy, Jason. Moving on to number 19 at Frontier. We have 7.1 mil, earning four positions since last time. And Helheim at number 20, getting dropped like a freaking dog at 7.1. I said it like that for Black Dragon, because Black Dragon has a rivalry with Helheim, and I like I, I kind of like Black Dragon. Um, and yeah, I wanted to be like spicy towards Helheim, you know, like, yeah, <laughs> like a dog. <laughs> okay. Anyway, moving on. Holy shit. Uh, let's see what they earned. So we got 2.2. We got 3.3 with the unknown 1.4 with Asgard barely holding on, on copium life support right now. Frontier 2.7 and Helheim 1.7. All right. They're doomed. All right, let's move on to the last tier of the top 25. It's rare tier, trash tier of Crazy Fios here. And we got freaking Last Damn Sushi. Last Damn Sushi Booty at number 21 with 6.9 mil total. We have ZZK at 22 with 6.6 6 mil total. 23, we have Black Dragon at 6.4 mil total, dropping down. Oh my, oh my goodness. We have at 24, Brazil Grind. I'm like trying to not burp with my fresco right now. God, it's so hard. Uh, Brazil grind at 5.4 mil, moving up a position. Good for them. And then at 25, I never thought I would see the day where slums the guild <laughs> would make it to the SGL because their leader is like on crack. Like when their leader shows up in our discord, he is like talking to himself, but then he says he's talking to you. And I don't, I don't even know how to interpret it. He's a funny dude, but it's just like, what is it? <laughs> But here they are at 25 with 5.3 mil earned the first time, I think. And congrats. Congrats to Slum, Slum Guild, you crackheads. You did it. <laughs> uh, but my favorite guild out, out of Rare is Last Damn Sushi. Um, they're, they, some of them changed their name to actual types of sushi. And they show up. They've been showing up to my stepping stream more than my Wolf blood Brothers have been. And they've been stepping with me. It just blows my mind how supportive they've been, and how 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 freaking crazy their guild leader is. He's just he's cooking. All right, let's see what everyone earned. So we got two mil flat by LDS. Pretty good for rare. Uh, one point five for ZZK. One point six for Black Dragon. We have one point one point two for Brazil. Almost one point three. And Slums earning was at one point eight. Damn, looking good. <laughs> Theron says dramatic eye roll. <laughs> Just support me, Theron. God dang it. All right. Let's hit the fresca. All right. So that's the top 25. 
Let's go into the tier two system. That's 26 or 35. We'll just briefly go over it. We'll, you know, we want to see who is fighting for the next position into rare and where some of the guilds have fallen to uh, that used to be in the top 25. It's always fun to see, you know, laugh at other people's pain. All right, I'll zoom out so we can see everything. But uh, for now, let's start here at 26. We have golden arrows dropping out of the SGL once again. Uh, rest, <laughs> rip, rest in peace. 5.2 mil total, and they're sinking like a ship. We have Alpha and Omega who were in the top 25. They're now fighting back. Uh, 27. Wolf, Wolf was in the SGL for the longest time as well, and they're at 28, and they've fallen. Uh, this could be a sign that one, we have a whole new breed of uh stronger guilds this go around, and two, guilds are dying. Guilds are dying. There's two. There's only two options. There's no gray area. You can't quote me on that. Uh, 29. We have Eternal Flame at 3.9. I don't even need to say the EXP. Anyway, 30. We have Step and Chill. Uh, for some reason, Cord is still trying to like revive this guild. It's insane. <laughs> it's insane. 31. We have Dante's. Oh my God. Dante's Infernal Room. 32. We have. <laughs> we have Teletubbies. We we just have Teletubbies. Who, who names for guild Teletubbies? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I laughed at this last time. And then let me zoom out here so you can see. My God, you still can't really see. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh, we have Demons, Demon Lord's Army at 33. They probably watch a lot of anime. Uh, I've been reborn in this world as a Demon Lord, and I have a harem, and I'm still a virgin. Uh, and then at 34, we have Blazing Beast moving to position four. They are cooked. I don't care what Vex says, uh, Blazing Beast, uh, Volpine, whatever the frick their names used to be, uh, they're going to be in Tier 2 Hell forever, maybe not even in Tier 2 for long. And then Afterglow, Afterglow was literally in Rare Tier, and now they're about to just get kicked out of this game, uh, out of this tracking. Like, they're dead. Let's look at the earned real quick. Bro, 7,000 EXP, do Afterglow is dead. Uh, everyone drop a rose at their headstone. And yeah, looking pretty shit. <laughs> Holy shit. My god. Alright. Well, chat. Well, that concludes the latest progress report for Season 6 of the Seasonal Good Leaderboard with In Simple Mill. And uh, it was spicy. It was, it was cooking. We were cooking in the kitchen. You know what I mean, brothers and sisters? But that does it. Um, thank you so much for... You know, shout out to all the guilds who participate and actually play the game to be competitive. Shout out to everyone who watches uh, the stream for the segment. And shout out to all the VOD squad who's going to watch this later. 